shot, baby. Whoa, that could be my new intro for 2018, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Billy, shot, baby. It's so crazy, redheaded hell. <laughs> Nothing. I didn't break anything. I actually, I did break something, but let's not tell mom. She doesn't have to know. Every time the new year rolls around, we're just like, okay, the number changed. That's good. Since it is 2018, I decided to create eight resolutions for me for this new year. So here we go. First resolution on my list is redo my bedroom. I actually kind of already did that. <laughs> I know you can't see it here, but I kind of cleaned up my chalkboard a little bit better and I ended up painting every wall in my room. It looks like a galaxy. Oh my gosh, my freaking Jedi Queen Sanctuary. I'm so happy! The second thing on my resolution is I want to find a new job. Not that I don't enjoy my other job. I really hate to leave the job that I have now because I've had it for almost two and a half years and I've met a lot of people there that I know personally and seriously. I'm just a small town girl, like seriously, I cannot go nowhere in my town without somebody like Yo, Sam, what's up? Yo, you look at the girl from the, from the dollar store. I work at a dollar store, you, if you didn't know that. I'm a cashier and I, I deal with um, crazy people every day. My third resolution that I sadly had on my 2017 resolution that was college. I really tried my best to get into school this past year, but it just is. The universe said, nope, not today, maybe tomorrow. <laughs> um, paperwork, basically, that's all it was, paperwork, just paperwork. I was uh, filling out my, my paperwork to get enrolled into the school for classes. I'm like, yes, I'm doing it, I'm going to college. And then they're like, uh, 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 uh. hold up, girl. It shows here that you were homeschooled. Oh yes, I actually went from public school, um, from kindergarten until my sophomore year, and then I was taken out of public school and decided to get homeschooled because people are mean and I don't like bullies. Uh huh. Well, uh, it shows here that the school that you went to, our college actually does not acknowledge the GED, your diploma that you received. So therefore, um, we cannot accept your paperwork. So you can get involved in charter school. I'm very sorry. <coughs> um, excuse me. So yeah, now I have to take a test to get another GED to get enrolled to this school. I'm fucking wild, wild, wild. And the fourth resolution that I have for this year is my two-year anniversary with my boyfriend. I'm so excited! Our anniversary is actually on Valentine's Day. That was our first day, so I'm super excited wearing a dress. Lord help me. <laughs> My fifth resolution for this year is kind of hard for me to say this because I've never... I've always been open to you do's and do that's about my story with bullying and I'm, I'm not crying. Don't think I'm crying right now. It's just it's, it's really hard. I've never said this on camera before. I don't want this to be a sad video now because it is New Year and I want to start off the New Year great but I also don't want to hide anything from you dudes and do that. I, I want to be another year clean from self-harm. That was something that I started when I was 16 because I dealt with a lot of anxiety and depression. This June will mark me being clean from self-harm for four years. So yay me! And I'll talk more about this in another year. That's another one of my um, plans for this year is I want to talk more about my story so that you dudes and do that can get a better understanding and hopefully I can reach out to some of y'all and, and um, give you some inspiration to keep going because you're strong and you can do anything. Don't 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 listen to them haters because they're, they're stupid. They don't know what the shell they're talking about. Half of them don't even know who the shell Ninja Turtles are anyway. They get the Ninja Turtles mixed up. If they get their Ninja Turtles mixed up, mm -mm, no, I'm out. <laughs> My fifth, sixth, I don't know what number we're on now, is I want to create new content on YouTube. I want to do room tours. I want to do makeup tutorials. Yes, yes. 
please don't leave. Don't leave. If you hate makeup, don't leave. I won't do them all the time. I promise. I will still continue to do my Ninja Turtle videos. I promise you that. I've still got a lot of catching up to do. Elle has not left the Ninja Turtle fandom. Please do not panic. But I just want you to do some good to see another side of me. Like, I'm not just a crazy red-headed fangirl obsessed with the color purple and lightsabers in Ninja Turtles. There's a lot more to me than meets the eye, okay? I want you to do some good to see more of who I am. Like, I do like makeup, even though I am a tomboy. I know that doesn't make sense, but trust me, we'll explain that later in the year. Just next resolution, please. My seventh revolution is, re I keep saying revolution. This is not a war. Well, life is kind of war, so I guess it is. I don't know. My revolution, Lucian, whatever the shell they are. I get back to drawing art more. I really, really slacked off on drawing art a lot because um, the thing with going from college in 2017, trying to go to college and just not being able to get in art school this past year just really put a downer on me of pursuing art, so I kind of backed off from it. And my eighth resolution is far-fetched, but I hope to get my first car this year. Okay, I said it. I am 20 years old and I want a freaking car that is mine, okay? I mean, I do have a lovely mother and father who allows me to drive their vehicle back and forth to work and wherever I need to go. But, you know, it would just be nice to have a car that is mine so that, you know, I can put turtle stickers all over it. All I want a car for is I want to just put turtle stickers all over it. Mother will not let me put turtle stickers on her car. She's just, she won't let me. <laughs> I also want to thank you, Jews and Jews, because without y'all, I would not be doing what I'm doing. I probably wouldn't even be pursuing college because... You Jews and Judettes are like always there for me and when I'm down y'all are lifting me back up so um thank you Jews and Judettes for that I love each and every one of you. Bye, good job baby Ellen out.